uh, I definitely feel not really necessarily slighted by them, but absolutely neglected. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. And in episode four of season 18 of The Sister Wives, many, many emotions came out with everyone just over Christmas. There's plenty in this episode that I did not understand. Maybe you all can help me in the comment section. But so a Christmas was at Cody and Robin's house and it included the kids coming down. They're being surprised with the scooter bikes. Robin doesn't seem too thrilled of the gift because she does say that they're dangerous. But if Cody wanted to get them, anything goes, I'm assuming. If you watched my sneak peek video just a few days back, then you know Cody mentioned that these bikes were not expensive. Maybe he had some connections to get a good deal, but if not, those bikes are averaging about $800 a piece. But Mary was also present on Christmas Day, which, you know, she already discussed that she's choosing to go there because that's where she's accepted. And it was so awkward hearing her speak about Cody and Robin, like withholding their affection. Even Cody explains that he has to tone down his romantic feelings or affection with Robin. And Robin says, out of respect for Mary, she tones it down as well. And I'm just like, okay, that's just, once it gets to that point, I don't even think Mary should be there. Mary says herself that she feels like the other woman. So Janelle and Christine had a completely separate holiday from Cody and Robin, and they both said that they liked it that way. It was so heartwarming seeing Janelle in her apartment with her boys and Savannah. She was cooking in the kitchen with Gabe. I mean, those are the moments worth documenting. It was so sweet seeing Gabe trying to like tell Janelle how to make the lasagna. Well, they were kind of working hand in hand together at it. And it was such a sweet moment. And by the way, Gabe is my favorite if you haven't already known that. But Janelle does mention that although she understands the big blow up fight between she and Cody, she doesn't understand why he hasn't reached out to Savannah and she feels a little bit of sadness about it. But Cody says that, he says Janelle is out of mind and out of sight and he's only going to focus on his loyal wife and kids. I mean, Cody, what the heck? Like, he even told his friend that he's portrayed as the bad guy, so he's just going to start acting like one. I mean, that's really foolish of him to say. I mean, I think he likes being around people that kind of boost his ego, if you know what I mean. In addition to all the craziness and sadness, so they did have a clip of Christine joining Janelle after Christmas at the Airbnb. They're all playing in the snow, having like a snowball fight and just enjoying each other's time. Honestly, it was the best part of the episode. McKelty, Truly, and Isabel did end up going over Cody and Robin's house for a separate Christmas. Robin even mentioned that she saved some gifts for her own kids to open up so it can feel like a real Christmas. But Gabriel does mention that he feels like his dad didn't make enough effort this year and he does feel neglected, which I feel... If he's speaking out about his feelings this way, and if you've watched the past episodes, you know that Gabe is not one to hold back. So do you actually feel like Gabe has not told Cody how he feels? No, I believe he has because he has in the past. Why not now? He says he feels neglected. He feels pushed aside. He doesn't feel wanted. And that's not a good feeling. He's still your child. Yes, he's an adult. We all get that. Adults still need their parents, you know what I mean? But for him to even push away Savannah, even Janelle says she has nothing to do with it. Why not even pick up the phone to call? But let me know how you guys feel in this episode. In the comment section below, I think this was just an absolute heartbreaking episode with some happy times as well. But please like and subscribe to my channel. You don't want to miss any sneak peeks for episode 5. Bye for now.